Oh, hello. I'm Bill Murray. On the set of Moonrise Kingdom, a new film directed by Wes Anderson. I play a, um, a man in the film. I've made a few movies with this fellow Wes Anderson. Uh, he, he's a nice guy. He's made some good movies. He's made Rushmore, The Royal Tenenbaums, The Fantastic Mr. Fox, The Life Aquatic, Bottle Rocket. I, I still haven't seen that one. Who's in it? Frances McDormand. She's uh, the lady who was the police officer in Fargo. She plays Mrs. Bishop. Edward Norton, he does a lot of psycho work. He's playing uh, against type. Bruce Willis, uh, playing a policeman. Typecast, I guess. Tilda Swinton's in this one, too. She's tall, she's Scottish, she's pretty. She can do whatever she likes. Jason Schwartzman's in the film. He looks great. He's got a real nice look. Bob Balaban's in the film, too. He's one of the... A great actor. I did a scene over here in this. Here, I'll show you. <clears throat> I did a scene over here. Are you able to drag that thing over into that bedroom set? Oh, yeah. <clears throat> I did a scene in this set the other day where I had to come down these stairs, go into that closet, grab an axe, come out and say to these little kids here, I'm going outside, I'm going to cut down a tree or something to that effect. I'll be out back. I'm going to find a tree to chop down. I've got a little bit of rum in, in me now. Uh, I, it's Sailor Jerry. It's a, it's a spiced rum. I had to work with a bunch of scouts and kids. No money can make that right, can it? You know, you hear about people having, like, fancy trailers and so forth, and their own personal chef and, you know, masseuses. We had tents. Tents, like... Pup tents. Oh, man, that's the greatest. Wait a minute. <laughs> hey, boy, this is really... Hey, that's how it is. Well, the good ones are made out of separate pieces. Yeah, this is a, this is a nice one. This is an old one. It's made out of separate pieces of, uh, of, uh, of, of loud material and sewed together in squares. You can do this at home. The director uh, is Wes. He wears his pants very short, so he likes everyone in the film to wear their pants really short to look just a little bit like the kind of person you might want to mug. But, you know, here I am in a cardigan sweater, sitting here in Newport, Rhode Island, living La Vida Loca.